Hi everyone, it's Rhonda from Fowlers and More by Rhonda and today I'm going to share with you my DT goodies for April uh, from Gone Artsy and all of this with the exception of two things are going to be all new products that are going to be in the shop and available beginning May the 4th so I'm pretty excited about these um, they are rather gorgeous so I'll get started with this new trim it's pink now again these are all new and uh, we're just now seeing these so there's not a lot of info yet available to us on these so just stay tuned this is a beautiful baby pink trim and uh, has roses and leaves very pretty and you can't, like I said, you can't tell it on here, but it is a baby pink. So that's one of the new items. And I'll just move this over here. Next is this beautiful, she has some dangly trims that are new to the shop. And this comes on a big piece of uh, sheer netting, or white netting. And i get this opened up here for you. And that's how wide it is. Let's see. Let me grab a ruler here. And it's well over 12 inches. Let's see. Close to 12 and a half inches wide. And then here is the end of it. That way you can see all that. And that would be very pretty trimmed out. The knitting trimmed off and using this part uh, on anything. Or you can even trim off these little pieces and use for something. Very pretty. I just love it. And this one is a white. And next, we have this beautiful trim, which I have absolutely fell in love with. Let me make sure I have it on the right side here, because I was looking at them all before I started the video. Isn't that beautiful? And again, you can cut it apart and use just whatever section you would like. Gorgeous. And for those of you who may not know it, uh, she sells her products in half yard increments. Uh, in case you just want a little, not a lot. And here is another one which I think is absolutely darling. And what I like about it, you could split it right down the middle here and use either side. So that's a beautiful double edged lace that will be new. Oh, I had it on the wrong side. And these are kind of raised, so it's really neat. Gorgeous. Another one is this beautiful trim here. And I just think that's adorable. You have the little bows here, and you could use this separately on something else. Or it looks like bows. No, look, bows or butterflies almost. Isn't that darling? I believe, yeah, this is the correct side. Adorable. And Deb's products, again, are 25% below MSRP. And this one's very pretty. It almost puts me in the mind of, like, teardrops or peacock feathers. The little eyes on the peacock feathers. And then these cute little danglies. Stunning. Love it. Next, we have these adorable little trims, and they're so springy and so summery. Great for those summertime projects. But isn't that cute? And as far as I know, these are the only two colors that they come in. Sort of a yellow with like a orange and a teal blue or green, along with a pink, and it has purple and white. Sorry about that. Those are just too cute. 
And next I'll show you this other new trim. And I really like it because you can cut these little pieces apart and use them as separate appliques. I just love that. And then you have the cute little fringe. Adorable. Get those where you can see them. Here we go. Beautiful. And then we have these two new cute little appliques. And they have sequins in them. And the colors are just awesome. Where they shimmer. Too cute. Love them. And then we have some new um, beaded trims. We have this. Isn't that beautiful? These would be gorgeous in bouquets. Love that. And then this one I'm very thrilled about. Uh, this has a rhinestone and a pearl every other one. I don't know if you can see that. hope so. And this is new and I'm thrilled with it. I have wanted some of this for quite a while now. And then what I think is cool is they kind of retract so you can make them, you know, they don't have to be as gapped. That's another new one. And then we have some new blings, beautiful, beautiful blings. And these are all, um, yeah, there's, these are all set in gold, uh, gold tone. And this one's all pearl. This one is pearl and rhinestone. And this one is also pearl and rhinestone. This one is absolutely beautiful. Well, they all are, but I have fallen for this one. That would make a gorgeous pendant. Centers for flowers. Gorgeous. And those are a couple of the new bling, and we have some more. Let me get those out of the way. And then we have these, and I think these are just adorable. They have like an enamel paint, paint to them. And then in the center, they have little rhinestones. And I received the pink and the white. And I'm in love with the white. I don't know if you can see the little rhinestones. Adorable. And they're very nice size. Love them. Great for those summer projects. And next we have, and I do not know what colors these come in, but I received the pink. And that may be the only color um, as of right now that I know of. But that's a nice size crown. I've never seen one that big. Too cute. And it is set in a silver setting. And then, of course, Deb has had these in the shop for a while. These fun little cabochons. Uh, she also has them in other colors as well as the pink and the lime. I call it lime. It's a really pale, soft green. And then there's the rose color. It's more of a rose color, these are, than a pink. And But these make adorable little centers for flowers, too. And... Um, it looks like we're going to be carrying some fun little molds. So I was pretty excited because I've, I've not got a whole lot of molds. So this is the one that I got. And it is little rosettes. So cute. So if you're into making your own resins, here you go. She'll be having these as well. I'm not for sure what styles or how many varieties that she'll have, but this is one that she'll be carrying. And then next, if you do jewelry, this is called a beer ring. 
and I finally figured out why because uh, I believe you can use it to don't quote me on this but I'm thinking you can open a beer bottle with it uh, if so that is pretty cool but this is a man's ring or you can alter it into um, you know something else and but it is really heavy and I forget what color of metal this is my daughter got my son-in-law's wedding band in this so it's very sturdy I'm thinking some type of a titanium but no I'm not I'm not sure um, I meant to go back to take a look but right now uh, of course as I mentioned in the beginning this shop is closed right now so I couldn't get all the information on it just yet but uh, yeah I have some plans for this so if you're into jewelry making and you know um, the men like stuff too uh, of course not girly stuff but anyways uh, I might want to check into this but it is very sturdy and the color of it is very nice I like that a lot so that was it was a little bit bigger than I thought that it was going to be so I'm going to use it for something else so there we go that is this month's uh, wonderful little DT goodies from Gone Artsy and be on the lookout again the May uh, May the 4th the shop will reopen with all these wonderful goodies and probably more so this is just my sample of them and uh, yeah I'm really excited about this trim a lot so thanks so much for stopping by and don't forget to check us out on Facebook and at our blog goneartsy.blogspot.com and uh, this week the 24th of April we will have this month's challenge at the Gone Artsy challenge group on Facebook uh, be on the lookout for that. Our uh, DT Amy will be hosting it this month and you could win $10 and a gift certificate to the Gone Artsy Shop. So thanks for stopping by and until next time, bye-bye.